Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to build your own electric skateboard. Okay, I just got something in the mail that I think you'll be interested to see. I think a lot of people will be interested to see. Let's check it out. Slight little concave in there, which means you can take any skateboard and attach it to it. So I've just put a slight curve in it, but as you you fix it down to the deck, it will conform a little bit to the shape. Overall, quite happy with that. I don't have any uh, more spare cells floating around, so I just grabbed some out of my torch. But the idea with this case is, it's got battery holders built into it. So when you go to build a battery with something like this, and you use the 18650 uh, form factor with the cells, they fit perfectly in there. So it's a built-in cell holder. No one's done this. Your cells go in there. Where's my BMS? Here's the prototype BMS, which this one's actually bigger than what it, what it will meant to, what it's meant to be. So there's a very quick mock-up, but you can see the two vesks. Obviously, motor connectors are taking up a bit of space there. Normally, that they, they would actually come out through the the wall there um, there's quite a bit of room either side of the vesks um, this BMS like I said is bigger like it's longer that way um, the final one will be longer that way to, to take up more room there and give a bit more space but that's the general idea so um, my battery factory is just finalizing the assembly of, of the, the Space Cell Pros. It has taken longer than expected, um, which I apologize, but we've got to get it right, guys. You know, I'm not gonna start shipping stuff out to you unless I'm happy with it. So um, at the end of the day, if you're a patient person and you've ordered a Space Cell Pro, you're gonna get an amazing solution. The vest will go straight into it. It'll have a on off switch, a voltage meter, a charge port, everything. And it just, and it will literally go on any skateboard. Look at that. So the, the case here has been designed to have weather shield installed around it. So let's go ahead and do that now. So obviously it's sitting up quite high on the deck, 
but that's intentional because what you want to do is actually get pressure down on it and that will create a seal on the deck see that and then you get a perfect seal around the edge of your case which is going to it's not waterproof but it's certainly going to seal everything in nicely okay let's see how it fits on this deck this deck's got like a w concave in it look at that The foam seal fills in, fills in the W concave. Once that pressure goes down, you get a perfect seal. So this is as close as we're gonna get to a universal ca um, battery components housing. I've thought about this for probably two or three years. And I had several other variations of my design. This is probably the simplest, perhaps even, yeah, yeah, it's probably the simplest and best option. glad I made the final changes with the design. Um, the original design didn't have this downturned edge. It was just the raw edge was facing out the other way. But after I thought about it a bit longer, I realized it's much better if you get that edge downturned like that. And it just houses the, the seal in there a lot better. makes for a much nicer finish so <clears throat> so I got this box in the mail I think it's got alcohol in it <laughs> which by the way I'm happy for anyone to send me alcohol okay that's perfectly okay not here Who's this from? Ah, my friend Ian. Thank you, Ian. Ooh, 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 ooh. What have we got here? A lovely little package from my friend Ian. Looks like I'm being spoiled here. Very much looks like I'm being spoiled. Let's see what this card says. I've got a card. Okay, this is, this is so nice. It's, this is my first ever gift from a viewer. Uh, so, thank you. Well, I'm just reading the card and, and a Greek, it says in there, a Greek friend from Switzerland, Konstantinos. So, I don't think that's your name, but I think that's probably maybe where you're from, I don't know. Um, but thank you, it's a very sweet card. Um, yeah, thank you, thank you for that, that was cool. I'm no whiskey expert, but this one looks good. 
it's well packaged. Dalwini Highland Single Malt Scotch Whiskey, 15 years old, bottled in Scotland. Product of Scotland, the gentle spirit. That looks like something. What time is it? Oh, the, the tasting will have to be later, like in 20 minutes. Okay. I think I've waited long enough. Let's just, just a little dabble. I'm just taste testing it. I'm not drinking it. It's literally a taste test. So, go easy on me. If I can get it open, would be good. Here we go. Smell it. Mm, starting to get a little whiff already. Mm. Mm. Smells pleasant. <laughs> okay. Literally. Honey, cinnamon, it's quite smooth. Mm. I think um, I think I'll sit down with one of these later, <laughs> that's for sure. Not a writer. Okay.